another testimony of if God is for you, who can be against you? Welcome, 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 welcome to another episode of 3D Boxing Podcast. We are back uh, with the second episode of the day. Uh, quick Hits comes at you twice a day, every day, 8 to 10 minutes per day, twice a day. To keep you up to date with the latest boxing news and rumors. Um, I, I missed this early in the day. I'm, I'm coming back to it now. I'm going to get here. Julio Cesar Chavez, son of one of the great fighters of all time, misses weight again. Again, Chavez Jr. is is, is the gift that keeps on giving. He, he really is. Um, it wouldn't take drug tests. He misses weight. He fails drug tests. I mean, <laughs> it's nice being the son of a legend. It, it's nice growing up with, you know, in the lap of luxury like he did. I, I know we have personal issues and his dad had struggles. I, I get all that. But he never had to fight for it. And this is a fight thing just isn't in him. You know, having to cut weight, having to go to war. He would have his best round against Danny Jacobs back in 2019 when they had that fight. Just quit. Just quit. <laughs> you know, and his dad gave the famous... <laughs> Face palm. Um, this is a fight with Anderson Silver. It's an exhibition. It's a joke. Make weight, though. Like, Anderson Silver made weight. Like, if you're going to do this, they didn't even do it at a real weight. They did it at 182.6 pounds, which is about 83 kilograms. He missed weight by almost two pounds. I mean, this is a joke. He can't make 182.6. What's he fighting in the super middleweight? I mean, this is just a lot right now. I mean, that really is tough to take. I'm glad we have him because he's the kind of guy who should make you feel better about yourself. Um, but in this card, it, it, I think it's in Mexico City. Um, Chavez Jr. embarrasses himself again. <laughs> Like I said, this is an Anderson Silver fight. You know, it's not it's not a world title fight. It's not even a real fight. But just that it's Chavez again, missing weight again. <laughs> I mean, I can't. I, not, nothing this guy does is serious. You know, I, my, my mom was cooking taught me um, not to respond to stupid people, not to react to stupid people. Uh, and I, so I, I, I can't help myself. I can't help myself. Um, <laughs> uh, they're taking a hundred thousand dollars from him for, for, for from his purse. I I don't know what his purse is. Um, look, this is a guy that was doing. This is a guy with skill. Like I'm not saying he's a world beater. I'm not saying he's an ex. He was ever. This was guy was okay. He had skills. He was a real fighter with real talent. How far could we go? I don't know. But the dedication was obviously never there. You know, he liked to smoke weed. He, he liked to eat a lot of food. He liked not to make weight. He never took this seriously. And he could have been good. And like I said, all things considered, he's not. he was not bad. Right? Like, he's a real guy who's won real fights. You know, most people work a lifetime and never get to, to where he was. Like, he was good. And then he does, like, he always does something like this. Guys, let me know what you think. Uh, Chavez Jr., absolute joke. Missing weight again for this Anderson Silva exhibition. Uh, comment below. Please like and subscribe. Please uh, follow and subscribe Subscribe to our new channel, Texas Boxing Scene, on YouTube. But uh, all proceeds go to Autism Research and Recovery. Um it is June 19th, 2021. Ivan Calderon is still not in the Boxing Hall of Fame. Let's make that change. Let's get the Iron Boy in. Um, from Texas to the world, thank you and God bless.
Don't miss a tweet, post, story, or video. 3D Boxing is on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Hit the subscribe button now to stay inside the ring.